What is that light? I can't see very well from here. Van. Activating 
Activating skill. Have some more! <laughs> I can live with this. You are a great help on us! Take this down! That one's big. Time for you to focus. Use a shark boost to get in the upper this hand. This will hurt. All you on yes. <laughs> I can leave the face. Nice job, Anya. Switching to maintenance mode. Maintenance mode engaged. Here go. Time for the main event. Boost gauge limiter unlocked. Nice. That went great. You're a true professional, Van. For the main event. Boost gauge limiter unlocked. <laughs> I'm powered up. Show them what you're really capable of. Take the sun. Boost gauge fully replenished. This will hurt. Take that. All you on, yes. Yeah, it's further back. Perfect chance. A boost would work here. Keep it up. It's working. Energy output at maximum. This will hurt. Activating skill. Skills. Give me power! Yeah. You're finished! Take me! Rampage! Boost gauge limit broken. Nice! Moving on up! This'll hurt. Here's a sharp full boost. Go all Six. out. Give them your all. Time for the main event. Band alive. Rage. Boost gauge limiter unlocked. 
All you want, yes. Activating skill. You did it. Wanna clear them out? Let's get to work! Show us what you're really capable of! Take the stun! Look out! Got a whole slew of them! Time for the main event! Boost gauge, limiter unlocked! A chance! Activating yeah. skill. That's how it goes. I'm stronger than ever! That looks like a nice chest. Watch out. That one's big. Great getting engaged. Brace yourself. Don't forget about your charge attack. Unleashing shark strike. Go all out. Activating skill. Brace yourself. That's definitely a campsite. I figured we've got to hurry. I'll take you on. This'll hurt. Over here. All for you. The stun. Perfect chance. Activating scope. Here I go. Glitched. A chance. Activating skill. Yeah, it's for the best. A chance. Use a shark boost to get the upper hand. Attack their rhythm your own. I'll dice you up. Nice. That went great. You kick butt, man. Leveled up. <laughs> Switching to maintenance mode. Get to work! Don't forget about your charge attack! Take the stun! Take this! Activating skill! <laughs> Watch it! Oh, no. That one's big! Nice job, Agnes. We've nearly made it to the plateau. Hang in there, Ida. We're coming. Boost gauge fully replenished.
bet we can rest there. Slot accessed. Shard skills updated. Maintenance mode engaged. Single element slot Main access. Mode engaged. Those guys have got the same eyes as those hounds. That's right. They're all lifeless shells of their former selves. Dolls that act purely on instinct. Maybe it's just karma at work. Divine retribution for our sins. Hard to say. <gasps> oh, Goddess. What happened ten days ago? You really want to know? Well, I'll tell you. The short version is... We were defeated. Completely and utterly. And what's the long version? 
It all began two weeks ago. We were cornered by one of the CID's Hercules units. I'd heard they pick fights with Jaegers and Calvert sometimes, so it wasn't too much of a shock. But in the end, we were no match for them. We found an opening in their formation and narrowly escaped. After that, we made our way to Cray and rested at their inn. And we set up camp here and started brainstorming ideas for how to get back home. And that's when those bastards appeared. We were attacked by a band of merciless savages, led by three leaders whose power was unfathomable. It was a massacre. They led us to ruin like lambs to the slaughter. They picked us off one by one until no one remained. No one but me. The next thing I knew, I woke up here. When I came to, the first thing I saw was that device up there. It was emitting that ominous red light back then, too. My comrades were still breathing. They weren't exactly alive. All they could do was writhe and moan. It was like no one had any will of their own. I was the only one who could move of their own accord. Except in the sunlight. I couldn't stand it anymore. And I didn't feel hunger. At least, not for a while. During the daytime, all I could do was cower in my tent and wait for night to fall. There was no way I could contact the rest of the Corps. Not in this state. And all of a sudden, I developed a strange... Craving. Our military monsters started coming back to life, and they were acting without orders. And my fallen comrades picked themselves off the ground. But as you can see, they aren't themselves. I'm so sorry, Ida. That's horrible. Why would those people kill your men? Were they the ones responsible for turning them into... that? Yeah. I think they used that device up there to do it. I tried to climb the pillar a few times to get a closer look at it. But my body locks up every time I try. Almost like I'm being controlled by some unseen force. I'm not gonna dance to the tune of a puppet master. That's why I'm ending it all with my own two hands. So, that's your endgame. You'd rather go out in a blaze of glory than die as a pawn in someone else's game. You got it. The flames of purification come up all the time in ghoul-related legends, right? So it's time for me to burn. The longer I stand here with you, the harder it gets to stave off this insatiable hunger. It makes me want to suck up every last drop of blood in your bodies. It makes me want to feast on your flesh. Even fairy looks like a nice appetizer. I could have that young lady as my main dish. But too bad that'd make a stringy-looking dude like you an unsavory last course. <gasps> Damn. Low blow. Stop this nonsense right now, Ida. You aren't fooling anyone with this charade. You're still alive and in control, so we won't let you give up. We know you kept your distance from the villagers and tried to steer us out of harm's way, which you're still trying to do now. But why don't you consider Fairy's feelings for a moment? She left her home for the first time in her life, charging into a world unknown to her and tracked Van down, all so she could find you. <laughs> and yes. <laughs> if you really care about her, then you should at least be honest with her. You owe her that much. While we're at it, let's find a way to save you. We can find a better solution together. Because that's what Arkride Solutions does. We help people. <sighs> Give this girl a little leeway and she starts acting like she owns the place. Now normally, I wouldn't let my assistant sign me up for work. But she's right. This is a job for a spriggan, so I'm all ears, Flame Eater. I don't mind bailing out someone who helped with Operation Mille Mirage. Man. 
I was being honest about wanting to suck your blood, but I'll admit, it's not like me to surrender while there's still life in me. It wouldn't be right to throw it all away. I'd be spitting in the face of Commander Garant, my puppy-like rival and sister, and my old friends in Zephyr, like my other sister and the man I admired more than anyone. If I ended it all here, I wouldn't be able to face a single one of them. So I'll press on. Ida, I am so happy. See? Everything's going to be all right. Oh, what a heartwarming scene. Those final lines moved me to tears. Although I am a little perplexed as to how you alone maintained your sense of self. But perhaps you had a stronger will to resist than that of your pathetic subordinates. You were the right hand of the Jaeger King, after all. You! Look what the cat dragged in. <laughs> Should have figured it was you. I might be a little off my game, but I could still sense you lurking in the shadows. You and those two Almada psychos left my comrades bleeding out on the ground. You'll pay for what you've done. Melchior of the Thorns. <sighs> the last piece of the puzzle finally falls into place. <laughs> Why, thank you. You saved me the effort of introducing myself. Allow me to clarify one thing, though. I am a fresh hire for Almata. I was with friends of a different crew when we annihilated your unit. Although the job did still come from my current boss, so I suppose I'm splitting hairs. That tracks. My unit wouldn't fall so easily to homegrown mafia goons. I take it you're the one who put that device up there? That I did! I had the once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to experiment with bringing the dead back to life. And I seized it. Yet our boss says the device is of little importance. Curious, no? What? The hell are you on about? Still, the experiment is in full swing, and nothing will stop it from reaching its apex. <laughs> Wires! Now let's throw a little twist into the mix. What's wrong, Ida? Well, shit! This isn't good. You have to get out of here. Just forget about me and go! Run! Damn it. The bastard's gonna pay. But we'll worry about him later. Ready your weapons, you two! Our first order of business is calming her down. We'll get your sister back, I promise! Right! We'll save you, Ida! <laughs> what fun! Let the bloodbath begin! This'll hurt. Attack their weakness with an arc! Activating your skill! <laughs> Here goes! Activating skill! Brace yourself! Hands <laughs> alive! Boost level maximum strength. Boost level maximum strength. I've got this! 
Great circle of light! Give unto us the breath of life! Boost gauge limit increased! I'll round them up and scatter them! Target locked! You're trapped! <laughs> Level maximum strength. Perfect chance! I've got you now! Burn! 
Here goes. Displaying enemy stats. Uh, eat this. Perfect chance. Here goes. This will hurt. Aerial Buster! My head is splitting. That's how it goes. I won't stop here. <laughs> I'm powered up! Mm-hmm.